This is the 46th annual Yellow Daisy Festival. Again, we hold it every year. This is the 46th year we've done it. Uh, it is a four-day arts and crafts festival, one of the largest in the country. We open up today on Thursday. We run through Sunday. We open up at 10 a.m. It's more than 400 artists and crafters. Um, it's consistently voted one of the nation's number one top arts and crafts festivals. And additionally, um, it's not just arts and crafts, but it's something for everyone in the family. We have live music going on. We have a children's corner with children's activities. We have a men's den with large screen TVs. So if you brought your man and he wants to come out and hang out there and watch the big game, he's not gonna miss that. A lot, a lot of your favorite food trucks are here, Happy Belly, Roly Poly, so really something for everyone in the family. We're seeing uh, multi-generations of people come. We see sisters and daughters and grandmothers and mothers all kind of come together and hang out. Vendors love it. It's just a great time for everybody. Well, we're at the Yellow Daisy Festival and this is our second year. We do these things called Seeds of Happiness and it's an inspirational way for people to spread happiness. And the way they started was I am a sculptor painter and when I would be done sculpting out of the clay, I took the leftovers and made these little smiles out of it. And I always kept a jar full of smiles in the studio. And if my friends were having a bad day, I'd give them a smile and tell them it's a seed of happiness, hopefully it grows. So they started wanting them for their friends, and their friends were like, we all know people that need, need a smile, so would you just make them and sell them? So that's what we started doing. It was about three and a half years ago, and now it started in my garage at home, and now we have 16 people working in our studio. We have two people that we have full-time employed at a sheltered workshop, and we have our smiles all over the world. I am Robin Booth. I am just here to make people smile. I've been bubbling for 14 years, been with the park, Stone Mountain Park, over 10. I started bubbling out here and they asked me to come on and just make people smile with the bubbles, which happens every time I throw one out. And then I have my own business as well. It's, it's all that I do. The Yellow Daisy Festival is fun and excitement and for all these families, all these children, it's, it's it's people coming out to see the arts and crafts, to get ideas, to buy things that they haven't seen, just to enjoy themselves at the park. Everywhere I go, it's younger old, it's not just the kids. If I throw out one bubble, I've usually got a crowd. So it's, I don't know what it is about the bubbles, even myself, but young and old, it doesn't matter. People smile and that's what it's all about. Making